The BBC has dominated the most watched TV programs chart for last year, despite losing its former ratings juggernaut The Great British Bake Off. Audience figures for the whole of 2017 show the corporation aired 19 of the top 20 programs, thanks to bumper audiences for Strictly Come Dancing and Blue Planet 2 all seven episodes of Sir David Attenborough's underwater natural history series made the list, with the launch, featuring extraordinary scenes of a bird-eating fish, pulling in the highest audience of the year with 14 million. Yet, this figure was nearly 2 million viewers down on the most popular TV program of 2016, when 15.9 million tuned in to watch Candace Brown crown the winner of Bake Off. Plus forum guy. D. equals I9 E16 F72 C68 FF794 SRC equals HTTP colon slash slash I. Daily Mail. Co. UK slash I slash Pix slash 2018 slash 01 slash 10 slash 23 slash 05 CDC 59 A0 E80 image M16 underscore 15156273 2344.jpg height equals 375 width equals 634 alt equals all seven episodes of Sir David Attenborough's series Blue Planet 2 made the list, with the launch featuring a bird-eating fish pulling in the highest audience of the year with 14 million class equals block sporter M share, greater than despite occupying all but one of the top 11 slots in 2016. The baking show failed to make the top 20 20 programs following its £75 million move to Channel 4. Advertising again reinvented by Teeds. Meanwhile, ITV stopped at being a clean sweep for the BBC, with the launch of IMA Celebrity, Get Me Out of Here. Attracting the 8th biggest TV audience of the year, more than 12.2 million people tuned in to watch Ad McPartland's much-anticipated return to TV and the sight of Boris Johnson's death Stanley entering the Australian jungle. Record audiences for Strictly Come Dancing saw it feature 10 times on the list, peaking with 13 million viewers for last month's final. Won by former Holby City actor Joe McFadden, plus forum guy. D. equals IDD 14 E9 F677 FA9 CFE SRC equals HTTP colon slash slash I. Daily Mail. Co. UK slash I slash Pix slash 2018 slash 01 slash 10 slash 23 slash 0582260800003 E80 despite underscore occupying on underscore all underscore but underscore one underscore of underscore the underscore top underscore 11 underscore slots underscore in underscore 2016 underscore the GRA 19 underscore 15156276045311 jpg height equals 446 width equals 634 alt equals despite occupying all but one of the top 11 slots in 2016 the great British Bake Off failed to make the top 20 programs following its £75 million move to Channel 4 class equals block sporter M. Share. Greater than the success of the dancing show came despite early backlash from fans that they did not recognize several of the celebrity contestants, and is likely to have been helped by a decline in X Factor ratings. Given the nation's love for baking, dancing, and marine wildlife, dramas like Line of Duty and Poldark struggled to challenge for a spot in the chart, with only the New Year's Day installment of Sherlock making the list with 11.3 million, and the only lit event to feature was the One Love Manchester concert, held shortly after the Manchester Arena terror attack with a star-studded lineup including Robbie Williams, Coldplay, and Take That, finished 19th, around 11.6 million viewers tuned in to watch the concert which was spearheaded by Ariana Grande, on BBC One. The figures include those who watched on catch-up in the seven days after each program aired, but do not include ITV's Plus One channel. Sir.
David Attenborough and Brian Cox to discuss Darwin in new science show Sir David Attenborough and Professor Brian Cox will unite on screen for the first time in a new show delving into the stories of history's most significant scientists. The acclaimed naturalist and the physicist will discuss the legacy of Charles Darwin, from his absolutely mad obsession with collecting beetles to extracts from his legendary 1859 scientific tome on the origin of species. Sir David explains his admiration for the famed explorer's book that shares argument and observation rather than jargon apostrophe. As the six-part BBC iPlayer series People of Science continues, Cox will meet Royal Society fellows, Bill Bryson, Dame Muta Frith, Sir David Spiegelhalter, Dame Julia Higgins and Dame Sally Davis as they explore the organization's archives and introduce viewers to their favorite historical figures in the field, plus forum guide.d.i243 A7F35 AAC6C161 SRC equals HTTP colon slash slash i.dailymail.co.uk slash i slash pix slash 2018 slash 01 slash 11 7 slash 00 slash 47 fa 36 500 Sir. David. Attenborough underscore and. Professor. Brian Cox underscore will underscore unite underscore on underscore SCRA 24 underscore 1515629991392. JPG height equals 374 width equals 634 alt equals Sir David Attenborough and Professor Brian Cox will unite on screen for the first time in a new show delving into the stories of history's most significant scientists class equals block sporter im share greater than Cox, who as professor for public engagement in science at the Royal Society, said, People of Science opens up a treasure trove of archival riches and tales of scientists from the past. It's been a fascinating experience to work with fellows of the Royal Society to tell these stories, for me, and I hope for the audience. These films deliver a rare insight into the people behind some of the world's greatest scientific discoveries. Some are household names, some less well known, but all have changed our lives, from Darwin's singular obsession with beetles to Alice Lee's use of statistics to refute the notion that men, with larger average skull size, are more intelligent than women. These stories illuminate the history of science in a novel and exciting way. Dame Uta takes on the legacy of Lee, an early mathematician who stormed into a conference of male anatomists in Dublin and took their head measurements to dispel the belief that men's larger skulls made them more intelligent than women. Plus forum guide.d. equals IFBF 5F207657D356 CSRC equals http colon slash slash i dot daily mail dot co dot uk slash i slash pix slash 2018 slash 01 slash 10 slash 23 slash 47 fa 35 a 6 0 0 0 0 0 5 7 8 0 image m 3 underscore 1 5 1 5 6 2 7 2 4 8 9 6 9 dot jpg height equals 371 width equals 634 alt equals the acclaimed naturalist and the physicist will discuss the legacy of Charles Darwin, from his mad obsession with collecting beetles to extracts from on the origin of species class equals block sporter im share, greater than. Meanwhile, Bryson explores the legacy of Benjamin Franklin, Dame Julia revisits Michael Faraday's work with electricity, and Chief Medical Officer Dame Sally investigates the impact of Alexander Fleming and Howard Florey's discovery of penicillin. The Royal Society's Head of Library and Center for History Keith Moore said, We love to look behind the steel doors of the Royal Society's archives and what better way to do it than by having flesh and blood scientists tell the very human stories of their great predecessors. Eavesdropping on conversations between Brian Cox and a host of other leading scientists allows us all to discover the intimate and sometimes surprising connections between key researchers of the here and now and their scientific heritage. What could be more inspiring? The Royal Society's People of Science series will be available on BBC iPlayer from Thursday, 
incredible moment a fish manages to open a clam on blue planet looted 0% progress 0% 0 colon 00 previous place get by the mute 00 colon 00 current time 0 colon 00 slash duration time 0 colon 37 full screen need text video quality 576p 540p 360p 270p foreground white black red green blue yellow magenta cyan opaque semi-opaque background white black red green blue yellow magenta cyan opaque semi-transparent transparent window white black red green blue yellow magenta cyan opaque semi-transparent transparent font size 50 percent 75 percent 100 percent 125 percent 150 percent 175 percent 200 percent 300 percent 400 percent text edge style non raised depressed uniform drop shadow font family default mono space serif proportional serif mono space sans serif proportional sans serif casual script small caps Defaults done minimize expand